Good afternoon. An interesting challenge going to Preston in the FA Cup. Just ahead of this challenge, how's the squad injury wise, particularly Phil Jones? Yes, uh, even Phil Jones, uh, I don't know for sure because it looks that this is not a heavy injury, but uh, I think Jones shall be difficult to play uh, Monday. And Blind, uh, I don't know, we have to wait and see how he recover. And uh, Roman van Persie had uh, also uh, uh, something. So uh, now I have uh, given the players a day off and uh, only the injured players uh, has visited uh, our centrum, but uh, the doctor hasn't uh, called me yet, so I cannot say anything. You were very honest after the burn again in your assessment of your side. You, you insisted that your side has to improve. So how annoyed do you get when you still have criticisms, the likes of Paul Scholes still criticising Manchester United? How do you deal with it? Do you think that, that's, that's getting through to your players? Do you worry about it? I don't worry about that. It's not so interesting, I think, because Paul Scholes is one of the fans, uh, I hope, and uh, he may criticise, fans uh, can criticise us, that is not uh, the problem. So, uh, yeah, I, I, uh, that's my, my, what I have to say about that. I'm used to that and I think uh, all the players are used to that, because uh, they are not for the first time professional football player. Does it affect them more? I mean, we know how strong you are and you take things on the chin, but do you think that sort of criticism might affect your players? Yeah, uh, maybe some players uh, doesn't uh, affect, but uh, normally it, it, it does not affect uh, the players and, and me neither. But you seemed a little bit down, a little bit negative on Wednesday. Are you feeling more positive about this game against Preston on Monday night? I was not down about the second half, so uh, I have uh, given my opinion and I'm always honest and I'm, I'm very pleased that uh, your co colleague uh, was saying that. So uh, when it is bad, it is bad and when it is good, it is good and uh, I think the second half we were the better team and uh, we created more chances and overall we have created more chances than uh, Burnley. So. Uh, when you see that, because uh, football is made for creating chances, we have uh, created more chances as Burnley, so we have uh, uh, one deserved. And when you uh, uh, look at the statistics, but I'm looking to my or our process, and then I am disappointed uh, that that we play in in that way, and uh, therefore I I have said that. But. Um, uh, uh, Next match, we have another match to show that we are still in our process and positive. And uh, uh, when you see the results, uh, it's uh, not bad, I think. There's something of a, a romantic feeling connected with the, with the FA Cup. Generally, we, we get all doughy-eyed about it here. Do you sense that yet about the FA Cup? How do you feel about it after your first couple of tastes? Yeah, I think it is fantastic <laughs> because that, that uh, I have already uh, described. Uh, so, yeah, we have played now for the third, or we have to play now for the third time uh, a, a lower team. You, you know that uh, the world is against you. Uh, everything, the environment is against you because ev everybody is for the underdog. You have confirmed it, but you are conscious to do that. And that's uh, more difficult to accept, but it's like that. Uh, but the chance that you can survive is, is higher uh, because uh, you are uh, playing against lower qualities, but you have to beat the team with big motivation in other circumstances and in the atmosphere of the, uh, uh, yeah, that, that everybody is uh, against you. Louis, okay, you last talked question. about trying to find the balance in your team. In the last few games, you've played four at the back and gone to the diamond in midfield. Are you any closer now to 
getting that balance right? No, I don't think so. I don't think so, and 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 uh, that's also the difficulty of this system. Uh, I I have played uh, now already uh, five or six systems uh, during uh, this competition, and uh, I'm looking still for the balance. But but this system is is more more uh, attractive normally, and I can play with more attacking players. So uh, that's the reason that, that I'm doing that. And in spite that we are um, uh, looking still for the balance, our results are not uh, bad and our defensive organization are not bad. And we score a lot of calls. So I cannot say that I am uh, very uh, disappointed uh, about that. But we have to do it now. And, and uh, normally you have to do it uh, in pre-season. What I see out there on the pitch, we would have killed for at times during Sir Alex Ferguson's reign. Some of the players that are out there, Angel Di Maria, Rooney, Falcao, these are players that grace world 11s, not just Premier League 11s or Manchester United 11s, 